Right, what's up guys, it's JD Gaming here, and today I am bringing you a rant and rage video about Advanced Warfare. I was going to be bringing you another part, the second part, in my multiplayer series today, but instead of having a alright time hopping on some Advanced Warfare and playing some multiplayer, I ended up being as angry as I've been in quite a long time. Yeah, I played two games, and I was bored within about half a minute of the first one, and I absolutely hated it. It's such a bad game. It was developed for console, and yet it plays better on the PC. I don't quite understand how they've managed that, to be honest. On the console, because of there being a lack of aim assist, uh, SMGs are useful and ARs aren't that good, so the bow isn't quite as prevalent. Um, ASM-1 is actually good. The EM-1 is debatably the best gun in the game. Because of just because there's no aim assist and it's basically hit fire, you just shoot from the hip all the time. Because it's got such a small reticle from the hip, it works really well. And the game is quite fun. No one is really that good because just off, it's it's a hard game. But on console, unless you're really really good at Call of Duty, you have a scuff, all that sort of thing, which doesn't work as a game. The aim assist is ramped up way too high. And yet, on other things, is way too low. You've got overpowered guns. The guns aren't balanced at all. The only usable SMG is the uh, ASM-1. The KF-5 is debatably all right. And then, of course, obviously, you've got the elite versions of guns. But apart from that, then this doesn't work. And the amount of people that have been put off by the game for it becoming a pay-to-win is astounding. I don't play the game anymore because literally everyone has an elite good as like five elite guns that are really good and if they're str excuse me and if they're struggling with one they simply move on to the other one it's that simple not a good concept sledgehammer when have people ever liked it when a game's become a pay to win it never works out for the community to like it unless you're ridiculously well off and you're lucky enough for your parents to give you five million pounds to spend on the bloody call of duty you're not going to like this. It just doesn't work. I mean, of course, I'll have some advanced warfare in the background for you, and you can just see that it just doesn't run properly. It doesn't function as a game. The code has many, many flaws in it. It doesn't work. Exo movement. I'm glad they put them in because it showed Triarch how not to implement them for Black Ops 3. Black Ops 3, from what the beta looked like, it looks really, really good. It's had good reviews. The movements work well. The only thing people don't really like about it that much is the specialists, and that's a tiny little thing. There's more things that people hate about this game than there are that they like. How unpopular this game was is that I tried to join a game of TDM, and there's one game I could get in. I go on Ghosts, which is one of the most unpopular games made in a long, long time, and I can get a game quicker on there. There's more people playing Black Ops 2 than there are playing Advanced Warfare. I do understand that some people will be playing on the next-gen consoles, but some people will be playing Ghost on the next-gen consoles. So you really cannot complain. It's just, oh, it's such a bad game. Yes, there are some good things about it. Yes, it was fun for a short amount of time. But unless you've got an elite setup where you've got about 60, 70 FPS at least, it just doesn't work. You have to have a good monitor, you have to have a scuff, or you have to be playing on PC. Hope you've enjoyed this Rant and Rage video, guys. I will be bringing you some either Black Ops 2 or some Ghosts multiplayer. I actually prefer Ghosts to this game, it's that bad. But anyway, I will be seeing you in the near future. And thank you so much for watching. Please comment, like and subscribe. Bye.